updated reviewer for let 2023 professional education number one at the end of the periodical examination teacher r administered a summative test in filipino after scoring the test papers she assigned grades to each test scores such as 95 90 85 80 etc what process did teacher r use letter a ranking letter b computation letter c measurement letter d evaluation answer letter b computation Number two, it is the study of man's prehistory through the buried remains of ancient culture and the skeletal remnants of human beings. Letter A, anthropology. Letter B, archaeology. Letter C, ethnology. Letter D, ethnography. Answer. Letter B, Archaeology. Number 3. Teacher D claims, If I have to give reinforcement, it has to be given immediately after the response. Which theory supports Teacher D? Letter A, Operant Conditioning Theory. Letter B, Social Cognitive Theory. Letter C, Cognitive Theory. Letter D, Humanist Theory. Answer, Letter A, Operant Conditioning Theory. Number 4, Visual Imagery Helps People Store Information in Their Memory More Effectively. Which is one teaching implication of this principle? Letter A. You will not object when your students daydream in class. Letter B. Instruct students to take notes while you lecture. Letter C. Encourage your students to imagine the characters and situations when reading a story. Answer, letter C. Encourage your students to imagine the characters and situations when reading a story. Number 5. Which is essential in the cognitive development of a person according to Vygotsky? Letter A. Independent thinking. Letter B. Social interaction. Letter C. Individual mental work. Letter D, Scientific Thinking. Answer, Letter A, Independent Thinking. Number 6, The design of the 2002 Basic Education Curriculum, BEC, is based on the principles that the main sources for contemporary basic education are the expert system of knowledge and the learner's experience in their context. This shows that the BEC is blank in orientation. Number one, constructivist. Number two, behaviorist. Number three, essentialist. Letter A, one and three. Letter B, 3 only. Letter C, 1 only. Letter D, 1, 2, and 3. Answer, letter A, 1 and 3. Number 7. Which assessment tool shows evidence of students' writing skills? 
Letter A, Project. Letter B, Portfolio. Letter C, Critiquing Sessions. Letter D, Daily Journal. Answer, Letter D, Daily Journal. Number 8. Ask to do a learning task. Joe hesitates and says, Mahirap. Ayaw ko. Di ko kaya. It's difficult. I don't like it. I can't do it. To which problem does the case of the student allude? Number 1. Unmotivated students. Number 2. Uncaring teachers. Number 3. Extremely difficult learning task. Number 4. Incompetent teachers. Letter A. 1 and 3. Letter B. 1 and 2. Letter C. 2 and 3. Letter D. 1, 2 and 3. Answer. Letter A. 1 and 3. Number 9. Teacher S wants to determine immediately the learning difficulties of her students. Which of the following do you expect her to undertake? Letter A. Require her students to prepare a portfolio. Letter B. Administer an achievement test. Letter C. Administer a diagnostic test. Letter D. Interview her students directly. Answer. Letter C. Administer a diagnostic test. Number 10. NSAT and NEAT results are interpreted against the set master level. This means that NSAT and NEAT fall under blank. Letter A. Intelligence test. Letter B. Aptitude test. Letter C, Criterion Reference Test. Letter D, Norm Reference Test. Answer, Letter C, Criterion Reference Test. Number 11, the result of the item analysis showed that item number 4 has a discrimination index of 0 0.67. What characteristic could be true about this item? Letter A. Difficult. Letter B. Valid. Letter C. Easy. Letter D. Average. Answer. Letter D. Average. Number 12. The theme of Vygotsky's socio-cultural theory emphasizes the role of appropriate assistance given by the teacher to accomplish a task. Such help enables the child to move from the zone of actual development to a zone of proximal development. Such assistance is termed blank. Letter A. Competency technique. Letter B. Scaffolding. Letter C. Active participation. Letter D. Collaboration. Answer. Letter B. Scaffolding. Number 13. Which of these activities is not appealing to bodily kinesthetic learners? Letter A. Making math moves. Letter B. Doing simple calisthenics. Letter C. Sketching, illustrating events. Letter D. Joining extramural events. Answer. Letter C. Sketching, illustrating events. 
Number 14. Institutions of learning are required to meet the minimum standards for state recognition but are encouraged to set higher standards of quality over and above minimum through blank. As provided in Educational Act of 1982. Letter A. Lifelong Education. Letter B. Voluntary Accreditation. Letter C. Formal Education. Letter D. Academic Freedom. Answer. Letter B. Voluntary Accreditation. Number 15. You intend to assess affective attributes such as the capacity to feel, attitudes, and behavior. Which of the following should you establish to ascertain the instrument's validity? Letter A. Construct B. Content C. Criterion related Letter D. Face Answer, letter D, face. Number 16. Which will be the most authentic assessment tool for an instructional objective on working with the relating to people? Letter A. Conducting mock election. Letter B. Home visitation. Letter C. Organizing a community project. Letter D. Writing articles on working and relating to people. Answer. Letter C. Organizing a community project. Number 17. As an effective classroom manager, what should a teacher do? Number one, she uses instructional time wisely. Number two, she uses her power to punish students for the sake of discipline. Number three, she puts to use the available and appropriate materials. Number four, she manipulates colleagues and students so she can meet her goals. Letter A. 1 and 3, letter B, 2, 3 and 4, letter C, 1, 2 and 3, letter D, 1, 2, 3 and 4. Answer, letter A, 1 and 3. Number 18, keeping track of assessment results from one periodic rating to the next is useful in contributing the development of a blank. Letter A. Regional Plan Letter B. Annual Implementation Plan Letter C. School Improvement Plan Letter D. Division Plan Answer, letter C, school improvement plan. Number 19, in the KWL technique, K stands for what the pupil already knows, W for he wants to know, and L for what he blank. Letter A, failed to learn. Letter B, he likes to learn. Letter C, needs to learn. Letter D, learned. Answer, letter D, learned. Number 20, which is one characteristic of an effective classroom management? Letter A, it quickly and unobtrusively redirects misbehavior once it occurs. Letter B. 
It teaches dependence on others for self-control. Letter C. It respects cultural norms of a limited group of students. Letter D. Strategies are simple enough to be used consistently. Answer. Letter A. It quickly and unobtrusively redirects misbehavior once it occurs. Number 21. To make the lesson meaningful, systematic and motivating teachers' example should be blank. Letter A. Based on higher level skills. Letter B. Interesting aided with illustrations. Letter C. Easy, simple, and understandable. Letter D. Relevant to students' experience and knowledge. Answer. Letter D. Relevant to students' experience and knowledge. Number 22. Teacher A's lesson is about the parts of the gumamela. He asks his pupils per group to bring a real flower to study the different parts. After the group work, labeling each part, the teacher gave a test. What would be the best type of test he can give? Letter A. Essay type. Letter B. Matching type. Letter C, Diary. Letter D, Journal. Answer, Letter B, Matching Type. Number 23. The difficulty index of a test item is 1.0. What does this mean? Letter A. The test item is very good, so retain it. Letter B. The test item is very difficult. Letter C. The test item is extremely easy. Letter D. The test item is not valid. Answer. Letter C. The test item is extremely easy. Number 24. When curriculum content is fairly distributed in each area of discipline, this means that the curriculum is blank. Letter A. Sequence. Letter B. Balance. Letter C. Integrated. Letter D. Continued. Answer. Letter B. Balance. Number 25. As provided in the Republic Act number 4670, every teacher shall enjoy equitable safeguards at each stage of any disciplinary procedures and shall the following accept. Letter A. The right to be informed in writing of charges. Letter B. The right to full access to the evidence in the case. Letter C. The right to appeal to clearly designated authorities. Letter D. All of this. Answer. Letter D. All of this. Number 26. In a multiple choice test item with four options and out of 50 examinees, which was the least effective distractor? Letter A. The option was chosen by 13 examinees. Letter B. The option that was chosen by two examinees. Letter C. The option that was chosen by 30 examinees. Letter D. 
the correct answer that was chosen by five examinees. Answer. Letter B. The option that was chosen by two examinees. Number 27. In their desire to make schools perform, the DepEd then published ranking of schools in NAT results nationwide. As an effect of this practice, what did schools tend to do? Number 1. Taught at the expense of NAT. Number 2. Conductive review classes for NAT at the expense of teaching. Number 3. Practice the so-called teaching to the test. Letter A. 2 and 3. Letter B. 2 only. Letter C. 1 and 3. Letter D. 3 only. Answer. Letter A. 2 and 3. Number 28. Teacher B is a teacher of English as a second language. She uses vocabulary cards, fill in the blank sentences, dictation and writing exercises in teaching a lesson about grocery shopping. Based on this information, which of the following is a valid conclusion? Letter A. The teacher is reinforcing learning by giving the same information in a variety of methods. Letter B. The teacher is applying Bloom hierarchy of cognitive learning. Letter C. The teacher wants to do less talk. Letter D. The teacher is emphasizing listening and speaking skills. Answer. Letter A. The teacher is reinforcing learning by giving the same information in a variety of methods. Number 29. Cooperative learning approach makes use of a classroom organization where students work in teams to help each other learn. What mode of grouping can facilitate the skill and values desired? Letter A. Large group. Letter B. Homogeneous. Letter C. Heterogeneous. Letter D. Wear a multicolored dress to catch the student's attention. Answer. Letter C. Heterogeneous. Number 30. Watson applied classical conditioning in his experiments and the results showed that behavior is learned through stimulus response associations, specifically the development of emotional responses to certain stimuli. This helps is in blank. Letter A. Interpreting reflexes as emotions. Letter B. Understanding fears, phobias, and love. Letter C. Connecting observable behavior to stimulus. Letter D. Understanding the role of overt behavior. Answer. Letter B. Understanding fears, phobias, and love. Number 31. Which violates this brain-based principle of teaching learning? Each child's brain is unique and vastly different from one another. Letter A. Giving ample opportunity for a pupil to explore even if the class creates noise. Letter B. Making a left-handed pupil write with his right hand as it is better this way. Letter C. Allowing open dialogue among students. Letter D. Employing MI teaching approaches. Answer. Letter B. 
making a left-handed pupil write with his right hand, as it is better this way. Number 32. Student M obtained an NS80 percentile rank of 80. This indicates that Letter A. He surpassed in performance 80% of her fellow examinees. Letter B. He got a score of 80. Letter C. He surpassed in performance 20% of her fellow examinees. Letter D. He answered 80 items correctly. Answer. Letter A. He surpassed in performance 80% of her fellow examinees. Number 33. Thorndike's law of effect states that a connection between stimulus and response is strengthened when the consequence is Letter A. Repeated Letter B. Negative Letter C. Pleasurable Letter D. Positive Answer. Letter D. Positive Number 34. Which one should teachers avoid to produce an environment conducive to learning? Letter A. Tests Letter B. Sit plan Letter C. Individual competition Letter D. Games Answer. Letter C. Individual competition Number 35. The test in English and Mathematics showed poor results in comprehension and problem-solving questions. How may the data be used for better learners' performance? Letter A. Use context clues in vocabulary building. Letter B. Give more exercises, situations, on comprehension questions. Letter C. Determine weakness in grammatical structures. Letter D. Involve parents in guiding learners developing good study habits. Answer. Letter B. Give more exercises, situations, on comprehension questions. Number 36. Vox populi est supreme lex is a Latin expression that means what? Letter A. The supreme being is God. Letter B. No one is above the law. Letter C. The voice of the people is the supreme law. Letter D. It is popular choice. Answer. Letter C. The voice of the people is the supreme law. Number 37. Global students learn with short bursts of energy. To maintain concentration, they required blank. Letter A. Frequent reminders that they need to concentrate. Letter B. Frequent and intermittent breaks. Letter C. Short and easy reading materials. Letter D. Music while studying. Answer. Letter B. Frequent and intermittent breaks. Number 38. The benefit of reading aloud is that children learn blank. Letter A. New vocabulary in meaningful context. Letter B. To value the present of their friends as they read together. Letter C. To make predictions by examining pictures 
and listening for clues. Letter D, to use their imaginations to explore new ideas as they listen to books. Answer, letter B, to value the presence of their friends as they read together. Number 39. What does a table of specification establish? Letter A. Construct validity. Letter B. Content-related validity and criterion reference. Letter C. Content validity and construct validity. Letter D. Content validity and content-related validity. Answer. Letter C. Content validity and construct validity. Number 40. A high school graduate was refused admission to a university on the grounds that he failed the admission test. The student insisted that he had the right to be admitted and the act of the university was a violation of his right to education. Was the student correct? Letter A. No, the university may refuse the student in its exercise of academic freedom. Letter B. Yes, education is everyone's right. Letter C. Yes, especially if he belongs to the indigenous people's group. Letter D. No, if the university is exclusively for girls. Answer. Letter A. No, the university may refuse the student in its exercise of academic freedom. Number 41. What is the primary fundamental question in examining a curriculum? Letter A. What educational experiences can be provided that are likely to attain these purposes? Letter B. What educational purposes should the school seek to attain? Letter C. How can these educational experiences be effectively organized? Letter D. How can we determine whether these purposes are attained or not? Answer. Letter B. What educational purposes should a school seek to attain? Number 42. What is the implication of using a method that focuses on the why rather than how? Letter A. There is best method. Letter B. Typical one be good for any subject. Letter C. These methods should be standardized for different subjects. Letter D. Teaching methods should favor inquiry and problem solving. Answer. Letter D. Teaching methods should favor inquiry and problem solving. Number 43. Societal change requires continually deep-seated questions about good living. Which of these did Socrates recognize as the greatest of human virtues? Letter A. Moral wisdom. Letter B. Fair justice. Letter C. Courage. Letter D. Pity. Answer. Letter A. Moral Wisdom. Number 44. The norms in a school culture are centered on the blank. Letter A. Learner. Letter B. Teacher. Letter C. Principal. 
letter D, supervisor. Answer, letter A, learner. Number 45. The discrimination index of a test item is negative 0 0.35. What does this mean? Letter A. More from the upper group got the item correctly. Letter B. More from the lower group got the item correctly. Letter C. The test is quite reliable. Letter D. The test item is valid. Answer. Letter B. More from the lower group got the item correctly. Number 46. When curriculum content is fairly distributed in each area of discipline, this means that the curriculum is blank. Letter A. Sequence. Letter B. Balance. Letter C. Integrated. Letter D. Continued. Answer. Letter B. Balance. Number 47. Teacher B discovered that her pupils are weak in comprehension. To further determine in which particular skills her pupils are weak, which test should teacher B give? Letter A, aptitude test. Letter B, placement test. Letter C, diagnostic test. Letter D, standardized test. Answer. Letter C. Diagnostic test. Number 48. What is an alternative assessment tool for teaching and learning consisting of a collection of work, artifacts, finish or in progress accomplished by the targeted clientele? Letter A. Rubric. Letter B, Achievement Test. Letter C, Evaluation Instrument. Letter D, Portfolio. Answer, Letter D, Portfolio. Number 49. Someone wrote, Environment relates to the profound relationship between matter, nature, and society. And in such a context, ICTs bring new ways of living in a more interconnected society, all of which reduces our dependency on matter and affects our relationship with nature. What does this convey? Letter A, environment and ICT are pulled apart. Letter B, ICT impacts on environment. Letter C. Environment affects ICT. Letter D. ICT bring us away from an entire connected society. Answer. Letter B. ICT impacts on environment. Number 50. Which of these non-threatening means of assessing learning outcomes? Number 1. Portfolio. Number 2. Self-evaluation. Number 3. Peer evaluation. Number 4. Learning journals. Letter A. 1 and 2. Letter B. 1 and 3. Letter C. 1, 2 and 4. Letter D, 2 and 3. Answer, 
letter A, 1 and 2.